I'm Tara Oracle, and this is my review, sort of, unboxing, kind of. Taro in Wonderland by Barbara Moore, illustrated by Eugene Smith. So, I bought this. I thought I was just going to get a tarot deck in like a little box. But I got this magnificent, massive thing for 20 bucks. I think it was 19 bucks. They have a coupon on Amazon that you can clip clip or whatever that um that allows you to get a little bit cheaper anyway this is just magnificent this is magnificent in every way this is i can't believe i waited this long to buy this what a no-brainer buy for 20 bucks my god the first thing you can tell is quality is it has a magnetic latch that seals the box that's just classy I'm so entertained by anything. It is so classy. And you open it up. Look at this. Just look at it. Look how thick this is. And I mean, look, you even get a little, a little string to help lift out your book. So let's look at the book first because, wow. 348 pages, I think. Yes, 348 pages. It's not like a paper it's this thick, laminated, glossy paper that's super high quality, too. And the graphics in it are absolutely magnificent. Look at this. Absolutely magnificent. So you get one, two, three pages of details on the cards including the keywords, down the rabbit hole, the meanings, things like this. Absolutely magnificent. Little places to do your own notes. Just gorgeous. Gorgeous in every way. Absolutely stunning for this book. And there's so much stuff in here. So she has spreads starting at 321. Sorry for the reflection, this is so glossy. So she has spread starting at 321 and you get uh, a basic spread, a simple yes no spread, tarot and wonderland spreads, falling down the rabbit hole, positional meanings through the looking glass, So there's so much stuff in here. So this is just the end of it. Then you have another layout there. Again, sorry for the reflection. These are all super glossy. Positional meanings for that particular one. And it keeps going. So, I mean, quite a bit of extra stuff at the end. Before the spreads, we go into the King of Pentacles, etc., etc. So, just a magnificent book. Just fantastic. Look how thick it is, too. That's insane. So now, obviously, the mainstay of the deck is the cards. And again, just pure quality for, for the box. And the cards are no border, absolutely stunning cards. Just look at the pictures on there. Even the back is cool. I love everything about this deck. This is the only deck I'm using for readings for like a month. Well, not really, but close. I'm going to use these all the time. Just look at how good this looks. Like, look at a close-up of this. If my finger would get out of the way. The Emperor, for example. Just look how quality that is. Just absolutely stunning. I mean, this will compete with many of the $50 decks that I have. Easy. The Chariot, Strength. I just like all of the, the way that it's done. Look at the Hermit. Just gorgeous cards. This is my favorite, the Wheel of Fortune. You can look at that up close. Again, good good quality cardstock, nicely laminated. The hanged man. And for card interactions, these are 
perfect. These are perfect for card interactions. Here we have a facing, another facing, we have barriers, we have movement, another facing, barriers, fighting, quite a bit of cool stuff in here. Movement, more barriers, movement, facings, barriers, movement, barriers, more movement. So this whole thing is just card interactions in a deck. Like if you do my stuff for 20 bucks, pick this up, pick this up, and pick this up. I can't believe what a good value this is. So yeah, all right, here we go. More barriers, spatial barriers, movement, regrets, reaching up, which could be card interactions for a card that's above it maybe. Uh, and things like that. Yeah, all of this stuff. Look, look at the barrier there. Perfect, perfect barriers, movement, facing, facings, more barriers, more movement, more facings, more facings, movement. It's just nonstop. This is card interactions in a bundle. And I love the no border. Like, look at just how colorful all of these things are. So I know that Baba Studio is releasing their Wonderland, re-releasing their Wonderland Tarot soon. And that one is 80 bucks plus shipping. I'm not sure they can beat this. This is great. Movement. Facings. Wow. Like all of the stuff. I love this. This is really cool. Look at the clouds. Look at how much detail they put into that. Really great. Page of Swords. I can't wait to read with these. Yeah, we have definite movement, off balance. So if you're off balance about something, which is another teach-in that I have soon to where talking about the different types of movement restrictions and the different type of movement issues that some people have like this again off balance so look for things like that for your readings so you're moving this direction but you're facing that direction and you're off balance so that says a lot about a lot of stuff there's a lot of things in here that you won't find in other decks so really cool very, very cool. whole deck is just magnificent. Um, as you can tell, I like it. Of course, if you release a deck, I'm just saying in general, just me, my opinion. If you release a deck and it's thick with card interactions, borderless, colorful, and you include a massive book, I'm going to like it. I mean, that's just, that's just me. But... Right now I have so many decks that I'm throwing some away. Um, so buying a deck is unusual for me. It has to be a very special deck and um, I'm glad I purchased this one. This one is, is definitely sets itself apart from most of the tarots that I'm seeing around lately. So thank you for joining me. If you like this video, hit like and subscribe. Uh, if you want a reading, hit me up for a reading in the description, I'll give you the email. I'm about 70 readings behind, but we're going to use this for a few readings and see how it goes, especially with the card interactions. I'm very excited. Thank you for joining me. I'm Tara Oracle, and we'll see you next time.